Incredible. We'll be down there sometime soon, maybe around tomorrow. Uh, we just dropped down into Caesars Crossing, and then that's where you could go into Julian. Uh, I might go in. I might go in just to uh, get some pie. Um, we'll see. See the snowy mountains in the distance. That's where we're going. Somebody left a, well, they painted a rock. And then put it up there. There's so many new things like that on the trail. How am I supposed to get miles done when I have views like this? Ah, that's just incredible. Seriously, I keep stopping like every minute just to stare at this beautiful view. I'm obsessed. You know, I've seen this view. This is my third time seeing this view and it never gets old. <laughs> All right, um, I'm a mess. <laughs> I haven't brushed my hair today, but uh, sunscreen time and then I'm gonna keep going. Today's been beautiful. Um, haven't seen anybody but though, so I'm sure that people will catch up or I'll catch up to some people. We'll see. All right, sunscreen time. Also, my face is all puffy. Eee. Salty food. <laughs> that's what it, I think that's the reason your face gets puffy like that. <laughs> um, yeah, so sunscreen it is. As a kid, I always thought uh, my grandparents would drive me down to the safari park and uh, the San Diego Zoo and whenever I'd see the rocks uh, by the freeway, these type of rocks, I was like, oh look, look at the dinosaur eggs. Because <laughs> they kind of, they kind of have the round ones, you know, so I thought, oh, it's like a big dinosaur egg. <laughs> 
Uh, as a kid, I, I loved dinosaurs. I still love dinosaurs, they're awesome. Um, and I'm excited for Jurassic, the new Jurassic uh, World movie. Oh. Just caught it in time. I'm here sitting taking a break and heard a plane over me. Just taking a little water break, a little snack break. It's back. Pretty cool. I think I'm gonna have a cinnamon toast crunch, just one of the little uh, bars, it's like a treat bar, and then just snack on some gummy bears, because why not? And then keep moving. Look at how pretty this is. The wind has stopped, finally, <laughs> and it's just a, little, just a little breeze, and it's perfect now. Oh, <laughs> look at this. I haven't seen a single hiker today, which is crazy. This is the first day I haven't seen anybody. So yeah, we just keep going down, down, and down. <laughs> um, down to Scissors Crossing. But I, I have about uh, six miles till a water tank that I'm gonna get water at. And I may camp there and then go to Scissors in the morning because that will give me about nine, nine-ish miles if I stop at that water tank up ahead. So we'll see. I call this section the knee buster. <laughs> I definitely remember this section uh, of the trail big time because I'm whenever I'm going down it, I'm just like shuffling because it's so downhill. See, it goes, it goes like that. It goes down. Um, it's not the easiest down uh, because it's lots of loose rock and you could slip easily so it's like you gotta watch your footing <laughs> but uh yeah look it's crazy we were just over there on top of those mountains and you know you just twirl around and you can see the trail right here this way this way and we're just making our way down um yeah it's it's been a really nice day today uh, the, earlier this morning it was pretty windy, but uh, right now it's just a perfect breeze. Alright, let's get down there. <laughs> Alright, so I wanted to show you, you can see the trail right there, all the way up. And this right here is where I said it's the knee breakers area. So that's where I just came down. Right there. So zigzag down. All the way down into the canyon. And then back up. And now um, we're going up, up, up. And then we'll go down into Scissors Crossing. But we're not, I'm not going to go into Scissors Crossing uh, tonight. I'm going to go in tomorrow morning. So I'm going to make it to the water tank that's about four miles from here. So, yeah, just taking a little break. Um, not that much cl more climbing to do, which is nice. Uh, yeah, 
Haven't seen any hikers yet. <sighs> Maybe by the end of the day. What is up? Uh, I'm about a half a mile from camp. That's where the water is. And um, I will get some water, set up my camp. I think I'm gonna cowboy again tonight because I know this section is known to be windy. Uh, so I don't want my tent flapping around and waking me up all night. So, um, Cowboying will be a lot nicer. So yeah, that's the plan. We're only a half mile out. And I don't know if there's any hikers there. I haven't seen anybody all day that's through hiking. Hmm. All right, let's get to camp. Let's see if anybody else is here. No, I don't think so. Perfect. Let's see. Where to camp? Where to camp? That's too slanted. I know the water, like, big tank is up here. I could try to cowboy there so the wind doesn't get me tonight. Hopefully. Yeah, I think I will. Unless there's a better spot over here. Hmm, over there maybe. Let me check. Yeah, perfect, right here. Okay. <laughs> so this is my trash bag. I just have a Ziploc bag. I use it as my trash bag. Um, they actually gave at the terminus, uh, they actually gave like a discreet uh, trash bag. So like um, your toilet paper and all that, you know, you don't want people to see what's in it, uh, trash bag. So that's pretty cool. Let's see, what do I want to eat today? Well, tonight. I could eat my chicken Alfredo pasta. One cup. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Alright, so my uh, peak refill meal is almost done. It's gonna be so good. Oh my gosh. Um, but yeah, tomorrow I will get into uh, Scissors Crossing, which is about nine miles from here. 
Um, and I'm thinking I'll probably go into Julian. Uh, I didn't plan to, but I think I want to upload the videos for everybody to see. And uh, it'll be nice to go into Julian, get some pie, and uh, maybe see some hikers. I'm like out hiking the hikers, I think. Um, I think I just need to slow down because it is way too early to be doing these miles. <laughs> Uh, it's too early to, cause I don't want to get to Kennedy Meadows too early, but I'm going to get off at my house at mile 340 for a few days, um, to let the snow melt in the Sierra, but it's still not enough time. So yeah, I think I'll just poke around, go take, take a Nero tomorrow, uh, and then probably the next day do a bigger mile day because you have to get to water uh and then eh, we'll see how it goes i'm just so happy to be out here it's ridiculous like today i was smiling like the whole day it's so beautiful um and now you know i'm watching the sunset let me see let me see if you can see it hold up oh So pretty. Anyways, uh, good night, everybody. I'm gonna get to eating this chicken Alfredo pasta and uh, just relax and get ready for the nine miles tomorrow. All right, bye, guys. Chicken Alfredo pasta. Oh, yeah.